we need to go through here for some reason. I, I totally forget this reason. That thing looks hungry. And it's friendly! Ah, oh, that's nice. Cool combination. Generally easy to make friends with somebody who's hungry. Just get them the food. <laughs> uh, yeah. At least in these video games, right? Okay, I've got a handle for this machete. Yeah, helpful animals are very helpful. I'm making a fishing rod with some, some line in a book. It's very nice. Okay, so it says I'm going back over here. I wonder what... Oh, yeah. I've got a feather duster. Sorry. Just picked up a bunch of items and I forgot what I did before. Okay, so I need this magical, magical bottle stuff. Okay, let's fill this with water. Uh, here we go. Oh, that didn't work. I need something else. Okay, this goes here for a puzzle. So clearly with this puzzle where you get to move pieces around. So I want red to be somewhere like something like that. Mm -hmm. so let's see. I want red to be above green if that makes sense. So let's go with this move purple out of the way. Both of these out of the way. How am I going to get yellow into place? I have no idea. Okay. So, but green here, and then red there. And now red is kind of above green if I move these pieces uh, in a counterclockwise direction. Just like this. I'll have to do something similar for uh, our good friend Purple. So yeah, move these pieces a little bit forward in the counterclockwise formation. That way I can slip Purple in here, and I'm just going to move everything clockwise fit into place. Of course, I do need to rotate this one a bit, just a little bit. Solved, and now I'm grabbing all these items. Nice. Okay, so I've got way more items than I know what to do with at this point. Uh, what am I going to do? Kerosene. I'm just going to douse this in kerosene. No, I need some, some sort of, uh, you know, fuel for it. Yeah, I still have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, I haven't seen this before. That would be the problem. Okay, nasty fish. Well, I'm going to use the fishing rod to avoid the nasty fish. This is a puzzle. So what is this? Clear the board. Press any tile. Okay, here we go. So this is basically Minesweeper. What? How was that wrong? Okay. Let's pick up a fish, drag a hook, and place it there. So there's a fish. Uh, fish there. Let's see. No fish there. Um, this to be a two, there has to be a fish there. In order for this to be a two, there's no fish there. In order for this to be a two, there has to be a fish there. Okay. So here, this only works if we've got two fish there. This only works if we've got a fish there and a fish there. Okay, found all the fish. Get my key. What do I use this key on? Obviously the locked chest. Beautiful. So this is the calming potion. Hmm. I need to gather all the ingredients and something to put them into. Do I have any of these ingredients right now? Oh, I do. That's my only ingredient. Okay, what am I gonna use my rock? Uh, maybe smashing, that's a magical hammer. Smashing the way to save my brother. Okay. Oh. At last, the witch's spell book has been sealed. Now no one will learn my weakness. The witch sent you for the book, didn't she? Foolish girl, you're too late. Once I complete the ritual, I'll live forever. Better not tell him that I can defeat him. Yeah, better not. That that that's something I'll keep. Wow, I am so not gonna mess with that guy. His magic power. 
powers are just incredibly amazing. So how can I save this book? I don't know. I bet that's what the calming potion is for. I really bet that's what the calming potion is for, though. Okay, we've got a dwarf thing. Okay, there's a dwarf thing. Cutting is the only way to conquer these vines. I've got a machete. Found a vine. Okay, vine goes here. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot I can do here. I need something that's exactly that shape. Oh, what can I do here with this book? A feather cup. What? Okay, I've got all the feathers in my feather. Well, that's quite a feather in my cap, huh? Okay, so what am I doing with that feather cup? I don't know. That fits here. This is glowing. I should gather some in my magic bottle. Empty bottle, sorry. I found reviving water. Oh, beautiful. I should probably use this on my mom, but instead I'm using this on the flower. Well, it's probably, you know, I did sail across a lake to reach mom. I mean, get away from mom. I was chasing the king, okay? I sailed across a lake in, in while trying to chase the king. And, and then he crashed my raft, and I, I was kind of stranded on the other side of the river. Walking back to Mom is not a good idea. I, I just don't think I can get that far. I don't even think the map will allow me to do that. Yeah, the map will not allow me to do that. I just cannot go back to Mom. I'm sorry, Mom. I love you, but... You're just too far away. I hope she's safe, wherever she is. She's probably at home worried about me. Oh, and I found uh, more ingredients for more of these potions. Okay. So all those items go together. It's a nice calming potion. I do need to heat it on a fire, it looks like. Okay, here's bandage. I'm making a torch. I need something that will burn, though. Okay. Am I using the calming potion? No, I still need to clean it off first. Okay. This. I thought I had to burn it first, but no, apparently I am just putting in the goblet, and let's go back to the, the evil book. Using the hint to warp myself there very quickly. Beautiful. Okay, please tell me you have The royal Dominic. family of Antaria were childless. In desperation, they asked the court witch Devora to look into the future. Devora saw two events in her crystal ball. The coming birth of the heir, and the king's death at the hands of a golden-eyed woman's child. The king became scared and used dark magic in hopes of gaining immortality. Is that Queen Grace? What? No, no. Lily's dad was not that evil monster. Lily's dad was a The nice golden-eyed woman knew nothing about this prophecy. She and her husband were happily expecting their second child. Then they received a letter from Devora. The sun faded when they learned that the king wanted to kill her baby. Yeah, that was pretty awful. The king became obsessed. He ordered his knights to find and kill the children at all costs. Warned by Devorah's letter, the golden-eyed woman hid with her children in the cellar. The king's guards destroyed the flowers in her garden, but failed to deprive her children of their lives. the children and instead they just stomped over the flowers in the garden these are not very good guards well fortunately maybe the guards were really nice people and decided murdering young children for no reason is a bad idea good on those guards good on those guards okay so here's the cave oh geez oh no there's the cave it's doing its evil ritual Oh, At last, I've found the dragon's tendon. Nothing can stop me now that I have the final element for my ritual. You know what? In my head, I just realized, what if that's not Queen Grace, but her mom? Nivella, Bye. I have had a vision. The king is close to finishing the immortality ritual. Once it's complete, then nothing will be able to stop him. Part of my magic wand has gone missing. 
I'll be able to help you get to the King's Palace if you find it and bring it to me. They kind of destroyed it right in front of us. I don't think that's possible. Any case, yeah, what if that's, say, um, Queen Grace's mother or grandmother and she just happens to look like one of her relatives? Yeah, it could be somebody that's related to her, not exactly her necessarily. I don't know. Could be that we're going to tie this into the main game and say, well, um, you know, maybe the king had a change of heart. I solemnly swear to use this spellbook for no malice and to follow all the rules of the ritual. I seal this oath with my blood. Okay, the price of this book's knowledge is blood. Ew. None of those things will pull out blood. Ew. No, 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 I'm not using pliers. I'm really glad that didn't work. That was kind of disgusting. Okay, so how can I take that out? Something thin. Pliers? Ball? <laughs> Got a grill. I wonder how to activate that. I have no idea. Very dirty. I need to get rid of the cobwebs in quickly. Here I place the grill. Gives me a uh, flint and steel. So I'm gonna set this on fire and probably use that to get rid of those cobwebs. That works. Okay, that gives me a corkscrew and a ritual dagger. I don't want to cut my finger with a ritual dagger, but it, it makes more sense than anything else. Puzzle. Okay, puzzle, 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 puzzle time. Okay, it's one of these rotate the rings puzzles. So, let's... Highlight that piece. Oh, I can't swap two pieces like that. Yes, I can. Okay, that's good. So I imagine one solution would be like that. Get all those reds in place. Maybe get all these yellows in place now. And now just sort of yeah, just sort of just swap those, spin these around, swap, done. That gave me a sh shining sun, probably here to activate. This is the best protection one can afford in this frail world, the metal heart. If a person places it inside their chest, They'll never know death from weapon or senility. However, they will lose the ability to love and feel. Your real heart will continue to beat, even after being taken out of your chest. Anyone who tries to destroy it will be cursed forever. Put your real heart into the dragon glass case. This glass can only be destroyed by a mithril weapon. Magnificent! You have my gratitude, Morin. his heart. Wonder if I'm going to destroy his heart incorrectly and that's how I get cursed because I am playing as Novella and she was cursed with that weird aging curse uh, in the main game. Okay, hey witch, um, uh, wow, she looks angry when I do that. Do you need something from me? Your wand. There you go. Oh, thank you for finding my wand. It's not as powerful as it used to be, but it's still capable of a few tricks. <laughs> All right, let's go to the castle then. A butterfly? Take this wand with you. Use the magic to turn wild animals into something to help you reach the king. A horse, for example. Good luck, dear girl. Wait, so I'm turning animals into other animals? That might be useful. I just don't understand. Hey, there's a jack o' lantern. Yeah, well, okay. Oh, I know. I'm going to use this helpful guy. Turn him into a horse, and that's how I'll get to the king. Great, so I made it all the way to the castle. Uh oh, that 
God, see to it that nobody enters this castle. Come along, boy. Yeah, I don't like that kink. He's not very nice. <laughs>